The summer of 1971 in Antler, Texas, was shaping up to be another long, boring, and hot couple of months until that trailer came and parked in the Dairy Maid parking lot. That trailer was home to Zachary Beaver, billed as the world's fattest boy. On that first day, everyone lined up to have a look. There's me, Kale, old Mertie May with her huge sun hat, who each time she is asked, why do you wear that hat, says, Why, to protect my virgin skin, of course! And that there is my beautiful dream girl, Scarlett. That is Tara, Scarlett's little sis, who I seem to get stuck watching more than I'd like, so I just can't say no to Scarlett. Can you do me a favor and watch her? I'm gonna go see somebody. Boy, that Tara is trouble with a capital T. Get her out of here! Kale and I have been hanging out on the roof of the Bolarama for as long as I can remember. That summer was no different. Letter from Wayne. Wayne is Kale's older brother. He's the nicest guy, but now he's over fighting in Vietnam. He writes Kale letters all the time. Wish I had a brother who cared about me like that. As for my family, well, it's just me and dad. Right now, mom's out in Tennessee hoping to win some fancy singing contest at the Grand Ole Opry. She left her pearls here, though, so I know she'll be back. The pearls might not be here, though. One day when you find a girl good enough to call a wife, she'll be wearing these pearls. Zachary wasn't too keen on talking about his family much either. His mama died and all he had left was a Bible she gave him. We got to thinking maybe we could help fill in that blank. That they changed everything between us and Zachary. Yep, the summer of 71 I sure never will forget. That summer when Zachary Beaver came to town.